All right, in just a moment, we're going to be hatching this little egg. This is my first egg that I've ever hatched in Ark Survival. I hope it works. I hope I won't kill my little baby here, but uh, it's pretty exciting stuff. So, uh, got a couple of minutes. It'd be about a minute and 30 seconds. This is an Argentavis egg. Um, the health looks really good at 99.4%. Hard to see underneath my hot bar here, but it's there. So, yeah. Waiting for this to hatch. Now this grows to be quite a big bird, so I'm going to have to get it out of this building after it's hatched at some point. Follow me. <laughs> Exciting. Never, I've never done the breeding on this. Oh, actually, I, I did breed the bulldogs in Aberration. I didn't Argentine this before. There it is! Man. E. 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 All right, there. So I had to hold the E button down, and now I'm going to name it Aunt and Baby. Uh, then I have to get some food. Not sure what. Let's see what it looks like. So it's gonna be what is it? Um Oh, it's gonna start out as a level two hundred and twenty. Gonna have a lot of stamina. Pretty strong damage. How fast this thing eats. Keep it topped off. So I think he just kind of eats and eats. So it's got a little timer that says when it's going to need more care. And uh, so we're well, just going to kind of keep track of what's going on here. Oh good, he's already set to following. I don't know if he'll move. Not not moving yet. Got another space for meat. So I guess every time it shivers, it grows and uh, adds another spot for food. That should be plenty of food. Yeah, back up in here. I don't want to go too far from the baby. Where'd he go? Go. Tried to follow me, I guess. Hi. Hi, baby. Oh, I got another, th another place to put food in. So we gotta get enough food to fill up this health bar. That's basically what we have to do. I don't want I don't want him to get too big. Are you gonna follow me now? Are you following me now, baby? Come on. Do it. Kinda trying. Uh, 
Every time he shakes like that, Ash shakes like that, he's trying to make her. But I don't want him to, uh, okay. So his follow range is really quite far. I need him to get near that door so I can get him outside because he's a big baby. Gonna get real big. Yeah, so he's gonna be, be a big bird. He's not gonna be the size of a griffin, but he's definitely gonna be a lot bigger than that. So as long as he's out here in the open, I can make him big. So anyway, that's it. I, I've, I've had a baby. And so now I'm going to uh, probably back later when he's all grown up and show you what he looks like. So I'll be back in a little while. Okay, now he's at the juvenile stage. Gotten quite a bit bigger. This daddy over here, he's going to get that big. So it takes a lot of food. You pretty much have to keep stuffing him full of food. Every time he shakes, he gets another space for food. Um, we're trying to get his health all the way up to the top here. So keeping that food in there is very important. But when he's full grown, his health bar will be big. 1,796, at least to start. And then we haven't even leveled him up yet so today is a good day to try this and how we go but he's only 11% tamed or 11% grown so it's going to take I think I'm going to be here for a few hours I can't wait to see what he looks like when he's grown and then I can finally fly him around and take him out to hunt that will be fun anyway that's the update on this taming process okay it's a couple hours later and my baby wants me to walk with him well it says we're at 60% imprinting and uh, we went for a little walk and now he it's saying that he'll need more care in about another three hours but uh, with the server rates on this server, this is not a vanilla rate server. Uh, he is going to be 100% imprinted in three hours because I only had to take care of him one time. And that's different than on the vanilla servers. So we're going for a walk with the baby. And that makes him happy. I don't know how long I have to do this. He's at 60%. But getting this exercise. Just running back and forth like this. So that's the caregiving aspect of raising the baby. Okay, here he is all raised up early morning I didn't have to get up he already had full imprinting by the time I went to bed at a hundred percent so uh, and that's just because of the server settings so this would be different of course on a server with the vanilla settings the server had a crazy tame rate uh, so this is my baby all grown up and I'm pretty excited uh, gonna be able to fly him tonight got some really nice statistics already I've put two points in since I woke up uh, he's never he's gonna it's gonna be a while before he starves to death that's for sure he's got some strong melee damage his health I'm gonna work on bringing his health up real high and then stamina uh, so get those two things up pretty high that's um, wait, you know, if there's any left over, I'm, I'm going to focus on stamina because they fly and everything they do is based on stamina. So, um, 
The less tired he gets while I'm trying to do things, the better off we'll be. And his health, so looks like health and stamina is going to be what I focus on with this guy. Anyway, that's my first baby bird that I've ever raised. That, that was pretty fun. Um, so, that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's not... It's not really a, um, a lesson video. It's just, uh, yeah, just something I wanted to record because it's a very cool experience. So anyway, thank you for watching and have a good day. I'll see you next time.